today we have another Disney collectible. Told you guys I'm going to do one a day until I leave for Disney World. But just over 30 days to get there. That means you have 30, 40 some days of Disney to go. Because yep. you're getting Disney while I'm in Disney. That's just reality. You're getting Disney while I'm in Disney. So. I went. What would be a good item today? I got tons of Disney stuff to show you guys. But I was like, what was going to be a good item today? And I, you know what? Pops in my head. I pulled this yesterday. Let's look at it today. Let's look at the Minnie Mouse Faucet Funko Pop. Let's get into it. All right, so today's the third day or the countdown till I'm in Disney, whichever way you want to look at it. And I was like, well, what collectible should I do today? And it was easy. It was very easy. I went, what better thing to look at than the one I pulled yesterday, the mini mouse faucet Funko Pop. Now, I did not buy any of these. I really did not have interest in these. So when this came in the mystery box yesterday, I said, this is probably the one I'm keeping. I showed the wife. The wife went, yes, that's cute. We're keeping it. I'm like, okay, so I guess I'm keeping this. I'm glad I didn't spend the 15 bucks on this. Personal opinion. This one's not horrible. The Spider-Man I'm not super thrilled with, but I don't know if these are really needed. But so we're going to look at this today in the box and out of the box. So this is what she looks like in the box. She was a Funko Shop exclusive. The one thing I still love is that holographic design for the 100. And I have heard a few people say, we need a Funko Pop like this. Just like that. That Minnie Mouse. That Minnie Mouse. We need a pop up. So Funko, get on it. Give us that Minnie Mouse. We want that Minnie Mouse. So get on that, get on that, get out, get, get, get on it. So anyway, we don't want any more faucets. We don't want any, I mean, the black and whites are kind of cool. I don't, know, I don't know if you've seen the black and whites. They look cool. I'm probably not buying any, but they look kind of cool. So I'll wait till I see them in hand before I make final calls. But this is the faucet one. So I got the Spider-Man yesterday, but they were looking at the Minnie Mouse. The Minnie Mouse was the one I decided immediately that we were keeping in the collection because I knew the wife would want it. And, well, it's Minnie. Who doesn't like Minnie? And I don't even know if I have many Minnie's. I don't think I have any Minnie's. Or, or, or many of them at all. Maybe, like, one or two. I, I have a Mickey Minnie duo pack or something like that. But, you know what, though? You guys are here to see one thing and one thing only. Like everything I do, I take things out of the box. No matter what they're worth or not worth, this was worth like 20 bucks, 15 to 20 bucks, give or take, as far as Hobby DB is concerned. So it was a good pull for a $25 mystery box. Overall, the box was trash. But we are going to take the Minnie Mouse Boston Funko Pop out of the box. Guess why not? Why not? We need to. We need to take it out. We need to look at it. We need to figure out why. We hated the faucet so much. So hang tight. We'll pull her out of the box and we'll look at her out of the box. All right. We have her out of the box. And the first thing I want to point out is if you buy this pop from anybody or get in a mystery box, make sure it has a stand. My stand's upside down, by the way, just in case you can. My stand's actually upside down. I was like, where's the pegs? The pegs are upside down. So just make sure it has a stand. She does have two holes in her feet to help her stand. She does stand without it, but make sure you get the stand. You want the stand. Anyway, let's look at the Minnie Mouse Frosted Funko Pop. I don't absolutely hate this. I, I don't hate it. I don't love it. I don't hate it. So I don't care for the fact that the black, which is I think supposed to be black, is like a purple. That's kind of weird to me, but whatever. Um, outside that, she doesn't look horrible. Like, I love the... The, like the see-through clear on the white on the hands, the you know, the shiny pinkish in the dress and the white, the see-through white face. Um, the fact that they did the shoes a solid color is a win. Glad they didn't faucet those. I mean, they kind of may have looked like diamonds, but they are still a solid color, which is nice. Mini. So I don't absolutely hate this. I would not go out of my way to buy these. Does that make sense? So you know how sometimes there's something you like, you're like, okay, it's good. If I'm there, I'll get it. 
but I'm not gonna go out of my way to buy to like to go get it. For example, sushi. I like sushi, but I'm not a sushi person to the point that I'm going to a sushi restaurant to buy sushi. But if it's on a buffet or maybe somewhere where I'm eating, that's just a restaurant and they have sushi, I'll get it. That's just how I am. So let me know what you think of this Minnie Mouse Faucet Funko Pop. I'm curious. I'm really curious what people really think about these. I don't hate, like I said, I don't hate the Minnie Mouse. Eh, I don't hate her. I don't hate her. I don't hate her. I don't love her. I think she's cute in a weird way. Um, yeah, I think this is fun. I just don't want to ever see these again. I don't like the purple. That purplish black thing they did is throwing me off. But I would love to know in the comments below what you guys thought of the Foster Funko Pops. Did you buy any? Did you appreciate them? Did you hate them? Did you want to throw them in a fire somewhere? Because I'm pretty sure a bunch of them ended up there. But that's all I got for you guys today. I just wanted to show you guys the Minnie Mouse Foster Pop, Funko Pop. This is for the Disney 100. We are almost to our Disney trip. We haven't been to Disney in over two years, like an actual Disney trip in over three. We're excited to go. So hang tight. You got more Disney stuff coming. And then as long as you stay here and follow this channel. So like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. As long as you do all that, you'll get updated Disney info while we're in Disney. Boom. That's all I got for you guys today. So until next time, y'all take it easy. Have a good one. Peace.